How does the VAT system work? Imagine a chain in which a producer sells raw materials to a factory. The factory uses these materials to produce bikes, which are then sold to a retailer. The retailer then sells the bikes to consumers. The first producer sells the raw materials for 50 euros to the factory and adds 20% VAT. He sends the factory an invoice for 60 euros, 50 plus 10. He then transfers the 10 euros in VAT to the tax authority without deducting anything because he's made no purchases. The factory builds a bike and sells it to the retailer for 100 euros. The factory charges 20% VAT on the 100 euros and sends the retailer an invoice for 120 euros. The factory deducts the 10 euros it's already paid in VAT to the producer of raw materials and transfers 10 euros in VAT to the tax authority. The retailer sells the bike to the consumer for 200 plus 40 equals 240 euros. The retailer may deduct the 20 euros he's already paid from the 40 euros and transfers 20 euros in VAT to the tax authority. The tax authority receives a total of 40 euros, which is exactly 40% of the consumer price. The consumer pays the tax while the businesses in the chain can reclaim it.